So to get to the answers with these guys, we set up an elaborate scheme. The first step of the process is live casting, which basically is like being mummified. This is really cool Hollywood special effect makeup job. There was so much that actually went into this process. Facial. They used the exact replica of my face and head so they could create a prosthetic piece that when attached to my face would make me look like I gained over 100 pounds. We planned this down to the very last detail. I needed new teeth, different colored eyes, different color hair, and of course, we had to change the body as well. In real life, I'm 100 pounds, and the fat suit, it's more like 280. To get used to the outfit, I went to downtown Palm Springs and walked around the street. Hi. Can you tell me where the movie theater is? Usually, when I ask for directions, when I'm 100 pounds, 5'2", guys will stop and, you know, ask me something back if I ask for directions. Can I have your number? You know, what's your name? And now they don't even stop. Can you tell me where the nearest movie theater is? Okay. It was extremely depressing to have people ignore me when I was the same person on the inside with a different physical makeup. Those guys, they just call me a hog. I've looked in the mirror plenty of times and thought, oh, I look fat in this, or I feel so fat today. It's ridiculous. I could slap myself because vanity is awful. Meeting so many guys in so little time, it's hard to know who they really are and what they're into. The guys were told that they were coming home to meet my friend Heather and my cousin Danielle. They knew they would be asked some tough questions, but what they didn't know was the major twist. This needed to look as real as possible. We set up an elaborate sting to make the guys think that I was leaving the house. arrived, I had a body double who dressed up in a pink jumpsuit. Heather and Danielle walked in and hugged the Milena body double. Oh, I have to go. I'll talk to you more okay, later. All right, bye. bye. My body double jumped into a car with tinted windows and drove away just as the guys were driving up. There goes your girlfriend. After they meet Danielle, the guys are going into the pool house. They don't know it but the pool house is wired with three hidden cameras to record everything they say about my larger cousin. And it will play a very important role in my decision. The guys came in one by one. Hey, get Hi. Hi. I'm Zach, which is... Heather, Heather Danielle. Danielle. I was at an advantage because the guys didn't know that I was in the soup. They just thought it was my cousin, Danielle. Hi. 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 When I went in and went to shake their hands, my cousin didn't even look at me. I mean, they were just staring at me like I was flown in from Mars. We asked them questions that would be uncomfortable in normal situations. Have you ever cheated on a girlfriend in the past? Have you ever had an affair with a married woman? What's the dumbest, most embarrassing thing you've ever done in a relationship? Uh, <laughs> where do I start? Um, <laughs> Adam was fabulous. He didn't seem like he was uncomfortable in the presence of Heather and Danielle. He was more uncomfortable about the content of the questions. Uh, well, I've done lots of dumb things. <laughs> My first impression was they were there to hate me. Okay, this is a scenario. It's Sunday and the Super Bowl's on, but Milena wants you to go to a couple's baby shower. What do you do? The Super Bowl is on? No, never, no chance. I guess I, I would go, but I, it would be with difficulty. Any girl that's gonna love me will understand the fact that I'm not missing the Super Bowl, but I felt like I couldn't say that. Describe the perfect evening that you would put together for Milena. Just really just going out, just having a good time, and just um, maybe going, like having a nice dinner, and just having fun. Maybe. Mike made eye contact with both 
me and Heather, and it was interesting because he seemed nervous to talk to Heather and Danielle, but he didn't seem uncomfortable in the presence of Danielle. I didn't really can see like a huge res resemblance. Milena has blonde hair, she has darker hair, but they seem really, really nice. What body part is the sexiest part of a woman and why? Oh, man, uh, I would say probably the lips. Just Jason didn't look at me in the fat suit. Maybe he was just attracted to Heather. You can see yourself kissing somebody. No. Okay. I was hoping to get the reaction from one of them. Maybe just a little sense of approval, but that didn't happen at all. Just kind of, they just smiled and I was on my way. Nice meeting you. Okay, you too. Okay. It's scary Hi. to face people that you're actually interested in and see how they're going to treat you. How important is physical appearance to you? You know, in a situation like this, physical appearance is not as important because you're getting to know somebody first. I never have or nor would I ever fall in love with the way someone looks. Zach didn't make very much eye contact with me at all. How important is sex in a relationship? I think sex is important. Um, you know, there's, it's, it's a level of comp compatibility. You know, I looked at Zach and I almost lost it. So I threw up the notebook and I was like, oh gosh, please don't lose it, Melina. But I, mean, I definitely think it's, it's something that needs to be there. It's gotta be something that both people enjoy. Really couldn't get an impression of the two girls, but as much time as I had with them, they got all the information they needed. It was nice meeting you. Very nice meeting you too. Thanks. Take care. In the end, all the hard work, the choreography, we fooled the guys. And now the question is, how are they gonna react? Tomorrow, I will see the hidden camera footage from the pool house. If the guys are down there making fun of me right now, and the way I look, then it's definitely going to raise some serious questions. <laughs>Still to come, they met Milena's alter ego. But what did they say? But At Metro by T-Mobile, we don't think you should pay extra for unlimited 5G. Introducing the big 5G upgrade.